Hi, I'm Vanessa Elise and I'm your celebrity makeup artist and beauty expert here in the heart of New York City at Rain Africa. Today we're going to talk about how to work with fragrance oils. Have you ever wondered how to make your own personal fragrance or even better how to make your own personal fragrant lotion? Well, I'm going to teach you today how to not only use the essential oils in body lotions, but also with home remedies. So let's take a look at a few components that you need to really pay attention to when working with these. Number one, always have a base. When you're working with essential oils, they really need to be carried in, in a base format. So for home cleaning, I love to work with distilled water. And for your body lotions, something that's super moisturizing is shea butter. So start with that as your base. Now with your essential oils, always choose organic. And the reason is, is that when you're dealing with oils on your skin, you want them to be in their purest state, free of contaminants and free of pesticides. This is the best way to go. And lastly, always look for small batches. So choose smaller bottles. I know I love to go crazy when I'm cleaning and go for the big bottle tactic. This is key, always use the smaller bottles because with essential oils, they really lose their potency when not used immediately or within a week's frame of time. Same thing with your body lotions. Keep them for about a week and they'll really maintain that fragrant, lovely smell that you've just grown to love. So for the home remedies, we're gonna start with a great blend of tea tree oil and lemongrass. I like to put in about three to four drops of tea tree oil. So one, two, three. It's really such a fragrant and uh, such a robust smell. So I like to always give it a top note of the lemongrass. Lemongrass is so fresh and it's so clean. And when I'm cleaning, I like to know that things are clean. So with the combination of tea tree oil, which is so antifungal, antimicrobial, you're really cleaning. And with the lemongrass, you're getting a wonderful fragrant smell that will last and intoxicate you as you're cleaning. So I put in four drops of the tea tree, three of the lemongrass, and then you simply just give it a little swirl, mix it around, and then you're ready to go. This is such a wonderful cleaning agent. I can't wait for you to try it. Give it a little swirl, you're good to go. So now for your body lotions, let's make something special. I've chosen a few of these ingredients that are wonderful for some of the common concerns when it comes to our bodies or things that ail us. Number one is lavender. Lavender is antifungal, antimicrobial, and it has a wonderful scent that's just so alluring. So I'm gonna place about four drops of the lavender in our shea butter base. One, two, three, four. Whoop. Don't worry if you add a little extra drop because it's just one more drop of the fragrant scent. And then I'm also going to add peppermint. Peppermint is wildly intoxicating. It rejuvenates and it also restores your mind. Let's put about three or four drops of it in here. So one, two, three, four. There we go. Lavender and peppermint are about ready to go. Give it a nice solid few shakes. This really mixes it in, and as you use it, definitely give it a shake so that all the, all the oils are mixed in, and you've got a wonderful, wonderful moisturizer. So that is your lavender and peppermint, and it smells amazing. This is better than anything you can buy because it's in its whole estate. It is your essential oils. Now we're gonna go with a little bit of the tea tree and lavender. Tea tree is wonderful, not only with cleaning your home, but also with antifungal and treating some common scalp and skin ailments. So one, two, three, four, five. We definitely have five drops of tea tree oil in there. And we're gonna add a little bit of lavender. It's a calming agent. It's something that you find in a multitude of products that are out there, but today we're making our own. We're gonna give it one, two, three, four, five, maybe six. And we're gonna give it a shake again. This is wonderful if you have eczema, things like that, any little skin irritants, this really helps to calm and soothe. And with your shea butter base, it really gives you that moisturizing benefit as well. Give this a little smell. It smells wonderful. And that is how you use fragrance oils.